Hello YouTube and welcome to GameSpire's first video of the Redstone tutorial series. The reason why I'm doing this, this particular series, is because I, I feel like when people play Minecraft, they, they don't really play um, the, the Redstone side of it enough. They don't really mess around with Redstone quite an, as much as they could potentially do. So I'm going to do a couple of guides and so yeah, this is a combination lock. First of all what you'll need is this, uh, this setup. Um, so where, wherever you're putting your door, um, be it here or, or wherever really, um, then you have to have this. Um, so make sure you've got a small chamber available to place this down. And you need levers. You need a, a lever on every single one. Um, I'll f find out why in a second. There we are. Now, set your combination first. Before you lay out the redstone, it's important you set the combination. So let's have two, three, and five. Uh, that will do. Now, place a redstone torch on e every single lever that you have just like pulled down. Um, and it will turn off, and that's what you want. That's what you want it to do, um, because that's going to come into play a little later. Now, connect everything up to this this little thing here. Good, good. Now you're going to make a redstone trail away from this particular gate where the torch will be on, and we're going to make uh, another gate right here. So. For this gate, you need this. You need one here, one there, and one there. And you need to attach this. I don't know why I just did that. I'm going to get rid of that. You need to attach this to here. That one. Now, you need to attach this. That's something I didn't do earlier on. One thing you need to finish the job is your button, which is going to activate combination that you put there and open the door. The uh, sorry, the door needs to be attached to this one here. And the combination lock needs to be attached. The um, button needs to be attached to there. Once you've done that. Once you've done that, you can attach it to the torch. like so. And you have your door opening for you. Now let's put it into a house context. Let, let's make this into a more of a house just to prove that you can actually attach it to a house and have a working house with a redstone door. There we are. So you, you kind of, you can, unless you uh, do some other methods, um, you, you kind of still have to keep the redstone here Unless you want it underneath the door, in which case you can do a bit of digging. Do that. Um, well, I, th I think you can hide it fairly well. I mean, this entire area is is indeed dedicated to the switches. But aside from that, you can make it into a wall, so it's 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 not really a big deal. Um, I made a little fortress, Game Spire fortress. It's a bit blank, but yeah. So. Here is real time if you put this door to use with the combination lock. 